we're gonna move on to a game that was shockingly a team that's gonna make the playoffs that shouldn't. The Indianapolis Colts. The Indianapolis you know Colts are in position if the playoffs started today, they they're would, going they to here. the playoffs. They're eight and six, bro. How you know like they had a, a troche. They had played the easiest schedule in the NFL history. all season. All season. Yeah, they played the easiest. They played their own division twice, which is actually good. But it's been they've been going back and forth. They right. played in a whole NFC South. Oh, let's get that clear. Right. Falcons Panthers. and the Steelers without a quarterback. Right. Exactly. My point here. They had Trubisky out there. Of course, you're gonna lose the game. Exactly. <laughs> I, I, I literally saw the report the day after the game, Monday morning. We both said the Colts because we don't trust Trubisky. Right. We both said that. We did. Yeah. We agreed on this one. Yeah. But the report came out Monday morning that Mason Rudolph is starting next week. I said, oh, well, oh now you want to bring Mason Rudolph back I mean, out. Again, that tells you how far it's going. To, and can I warn Pittsburgh fans? There's rumors about Mike Tomlin getting fired. Y'all would be absolutely ridiculous. Be replaced by who? Mitchell Trubisky. If Mitchell Trubisky gets the Hall of Fame, Mike Tomlin fired. That's what they're talking about. It's not even his fault. He don't have a quarterback. I, I agree 100%. <laughs> he got hurt, and you put Mitchell Trubisky out there. Why? I do not they put him on Sometimes, the like, the players, these new school players don't really like – he got old school mentality. Man, black Air Force energy all day, every oh, oh, day, twice they on they Sunday. Effort. They said because huh? the team don't be giving out the full effort. They got receivers not running routes, just walking routes, not catching the ball, not blocking. Sometimes they need a player coach. Tomlin is not – he's a player coach, but he's a disciplinary. Man, this new generation want to play flag football. They don't even want to tackle That's what no I'm more. saying. They don't want no real coach. They don't even want to tackle no more. They want one of them little pushover coaches like uh, Kingsbury, Brandon Staley, Frank Wright. Zach Taylor. <laughs> yeah, the, the exact, Zach Taylor gets lucky because he got Burrow and Chase. He got he got weapons. You Higgins. know what I'm saying? No, he gets really lucky because Higgins. he got the weapons. Exactly. You saw, what T, you saw what T. Higgins did to get that touchdown, y'all. Yeah, that was disrespectful. That was really disrespectful. You know it's bad yeah. when Justin Jefferson went over there and talked to. He's like, "Yo, that yo, that touchdown back there, that's great." <laughs> right. Like, like, what you you know, he, that's great. when when the yeah. other team's best receiver got to come talk to you, like, "Yo, I don't know how you pulled that off, bro." Mm -hmm. That was crazy. But I will say this though, and I don't say this often about Garner Minshew, but two fifteen, three TDs, and no picks, eighteen and twenty eight. I wish we could get this one every week. That's the Garner uh, Minshew I want. You won't get that every week. We all know that. Know. He, 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 <laughs> do it every three, he do it every three games. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> He'll give you one good game, uh, another okay game, and the other one's going to be terrible. <laughs> he's going to cost you. By the third game, he's going to cost you. You're going to want to fire him. You're like, really? <laughs> Why are you pissed off? I can't stand Garner Minshew, man. Because he has nobody the talent, can. but he can't – for some reason, he can't string them together to save his yeah, life. Yeah, nobody can stand Gardner Minshew. Ugh. He showed hey, – hey, oh, um, help me understand. The report came out that uh, Pittman Jr. had a brain injury? He got a concussion. Oh, uh, okay. He got hit really hard. That's why. I don't know why the report made it seem like it was worse than – I was like, damn, what kind of injury? It was the way he got hit and landed. That's why. But okay. it's, a, it's a mild concussion, so he probably won't play this week. Uh they gonna, they gonna, like a worse than normal concussion. We'll check we'll check next week's schedule. They they yeah. might lose next week because they needed him. Right. I never thought yeah. I said either. He used to drop the ball so much I, I couldn't mean, stand. It's a best option. He, now because Zach Moss, yeah. Well, right. I mean Zach Moss got hurt. They running out running backs. Ugh. Right. Taylor might be back next week. Hopefully, Steelers come to their senses and say, Mike Tomlin, this ain't your fault. Look, we we failed you. As a front office, we we didn't give you the weapons. They've only had three head coaches. They hold span. But I'd rather Tomlin resign than get fired. Exactly. They might right. I don't think that. That's not, that's not he, in him though. He's not a quit. He's not a quitter. I know he ain't. But <laughs> so we all know that Steelers ain't winning no Super Bowl no time soon. Not this era. No. Exactly. I mean, he should. I would force my way out if I could. You gonna have to pay pay me pay me what you owe me, and I'm a war. Right. Give me my severance package. 
and my right. and my gold jacket because I'm going to Canton. I'm 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 leaving right. Pittsburgh and I'm on my way to Canton. 